What's going on guys? This is Water Dragon and I'm about to do an analysis on a video from Cut uh, Double Blind Dates Play Fear Pong Fear Pong Cut and uh, just so you know I already saw the video uh, and immediately afterwards I just wanted to do an analysis on this because there was just a lot of things uh, that's just uh, awkward and cringe-worthy cringe so we're gonna go straight into it real quick and I'm gonna analyze a couple of things and hopefully you guys have the same you know thought process and understanding as I do about this about why it's so awkward on this particular uh, video so let's get right into it okay so right off the bat <laughs> this this it's just the sound of it and just both of them have no pants, blindfolded. <laughs> it's just not something that you want to see I'm or Michaela. hear. I'm Aaron. I'm Lucas. Why are you guys here? Yeah, I just thought it would be a fun thing to do. I don't really care one way or the other how it goes in the end. Dope. One, two, three. Oh, <laughs> Hi. Hello. Okay, so this is a little experiment. You guys are essentially dating two people from across the table. You guys are hot for sure. Yeah. For sure. You're down to do this. You're probably like a generally cool person. Yeah. So, what porn do you watch? <laughs> That's a good question. That's how you get to know somebody. Well, her in particular is just like a girl on girl. Straight to it, and it's not something that you would normally what say. What you guys watch? But I'm it shows how girl. open she is. Gangbang. I mean, not me. I watch it. <laughs> I'm more with you guys, though. Lesbian? Lesbian? Yeah. Nice. Are you bisexual? Oh, yeah. I figured that. Of course. Yeah. I figured that. Why'd you figure that? I figured that. You give off the vibe. Yeah. yeah. It's all good, though. I'm into girls, too, though. Oh, nice. <laughs> yes. And that, I'm going to pause it right there for a second. That moment right there. They both looked at them as soon as they both said, I'm in the girls too. And then they both high fived each other. It was at that moment. It was at that moment that they realized that this might not go well. Or their reaction was in a way where it's like, oh, this is so gonna be hot. Like they're gonna have more than a uh, three way or something like that. But uh, it's right there. That, that that reaction from both of them, they knew something was up. Something was gonna happen. Yes! Demonstrate your favorite sex positions with your teammate. <laughs> the dude. We got this guy right here. Dude, his face was like, oh, you're one of those guys. <laughs> <laughs> this right here. I mean, this is kind of odd. But no, I agree. No? Good. I got it. You're good. Okay, cool. Okay. I thought it was interesting. Something I've never seen before. Yeah, not something that I would see. On the count of three, point to which date you find most attractive. One, two, three. I pointed out Lucas. I choose Aaron. Okay, now I'm going to pause that one too. This point. The pointing of which one was more attractive, that that shouldn't have been a question. That really shouldn't have been, because uh, that is basically something that will completely destroy your self-esteem completely if you weren't picked. So fortunately in this case that both uh, girls pointed at different guys, but here's the thing. I'm assuming that this is how it's supposed to be, that they're supposed to be dating the person directly in front of them. So, like, uh, I believe his name is Lucas, uh, with the, the, uh, uh, whatever her name is, the, the black girl, and the black guy with the, the, uh, white girl. So, I'm assuming that's what it was. So, they both pointed at each other, uh, from across the table, right? So, anyway, blah, blah, blah. The point is, is that that shouldn't have been a question, because if both girls was to pick someone else, and I was not the one that was attractive, that would destroy my self-esteem, and I'll be like, I don't have, a, I don't have any chance with any of them. That shouldn't have been a question on blind dates. Like that's just, 
messed up. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, which one, which one of us is cuter? I like Michaela's personality better, but I think Anya, you're cuter. Cool. Oh. Yeah. Anya, yeah. Yeah. Oh, I said Anya. Oh, yeah. I said Anya. Oh, yeah. This is terrible. Okay. Another awkward moment. Another awkward moment. Uh, basically, it's the same exact thing. You know, he said he was basically comp complimenting both of them, but uh, he says that Anya is more cuter. So the question was, who's more attractive? So he thinks Anya. And the black guy said that uh, it was Anya too, even though he was like, eh, Anya, Anya, Anya. That, the way that he just says it was just uh, awkward too. It was just, <laughs> these, these people need to, <laughs> this whole thing is just messed up so far. Yes. Call your mother and have them endorse you as an eligible suitor. I don't even, what the, what? Call your mom and have her say like, yeah, like, you should date my son. Oh, you wanna do that? <laughs> I'll do it. Hey mom, yeah, I'm on a blind date with two beautiful women. We're playing this game where I have to do these dares, right? So okay. just pitch me, why, why would I be a good suitor? Oh my God, you're extremely smart, extremely empathetic, warm-hearted, funny, conscientious, pretty amazing uh, physique, if, if I do say so myself, because I help make you. What's your mom's name? That one was a little... Hey, Mom, I'm on a date with two uh, beautiful women, right? What do you want, Aaron? <laughs> I need you to sell me to them. Like, just boast Boy, me up. Goodbye. No, 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 don't hang up. I'm on a game show. Did she hang up? No, she, yeah, she did, yeah. <laughs> All right, that, that was funny, though. That was funny. Uh, he, it's not supposed to be a typical black woman, but <laughs> that was the moment right there. Open up about your worst fears and insecurities. Wait. All, do all four of us spoon? I'm afraid of uh, commitment. I, I agree, I'm afraid of commitment. I don't wanna be average. I used to be so insecure about my ass, but really? then really? as I got older, I'm just like, having an ass, I guess is a good thing, I mean. <laughs> uh, I never heard so of a like, guy being what insecure about a butt before. I've never but really been this in is like about opening a relationship up, so. in th the traditional sense because that, I don't think it's ever like good. fit into my life in a way that I wanted it to. Were you too busy? Always too fucking busy. But also like... Like with what? <laughs> oh man. Oh, oh yes. Nice. Seductively eat a banana. Whoever underperforms must play without pants on for the rest of the game. Yeah, they're going to be the judge. Oh my god. Is this hot? No. 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 Oh yeah, all the way in there. <laughs> Three, two, one. Who's the best? Lucas. I think Aaron. Oh, I think you guys have to have your pants off. I think that's how it's how it goes. You guys see yourself getting All right, married. I'm not gonna lie, I would I do. I am daring. I am daring on uh, doing certain things, but. I'm focused on myself. There's just some things that's just I'm like sure. borderline. I probably will do like it, but I probably Whatever. will. I mean, I think it's like kind of an archaic institution. I don't know. Oh, what? I, would like, I, don't know. I think it's like outdated. I don't do really? it. Do you do, just do it. Really, she thinks that it's outdated to get married? Oh, what sort of birth control situation do you guys prefer? Uh, I'm just gonna, uh, I guess you could say preach a little bit. Look, uh, when you want to uh, be with someone for the rest of your life, you know, you would want to assemble it by marriage. Otherwise, it's just a regular boyfriend and girlfriend. Now, on the other hand, yes, uh, if you're gonna be, if you're married, it's technically the same thing, but at the same time, it just symbolizes, you know, that you're committed to that person for the rest of your life. You know, till death do us part, you know, does that mean anything to anyone anymore? I'm pretty sure it does. But, you know, if she's not looking for a marriage, then she's just looking for a fling for the rest of her life. That's just what I heard. You guys prefer, like, if there was, if there was a male hormonal birth control, would you get on it? Absolutely. No. <laughs> no? <laughs> no? No. Why not? I don't think I would take birth control pills. I don't think I would do that. But well, like, literally, why not? I don't know, I just, no. I'd rather just put on a condom. You'd rather, yeah, okay. Or pull out, okay. which is. <laughs> like, at this point, I'm kind of like. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, seemed like a turn off. Yeah. Okay. yeah. Another moment. 
yeah, the, there's just so many moments right here. Look, uh, basically it's all uh, from that uh, Anya, I think her name is. Uh, why would you ask that question and then get mad over it because there's no such thing as whatever it is that you just said, male birth control pills. So here's the thing. The uh, one guy said, yeah, sure, okay, whatever. And the black guy says, no, she gets pissed. Why? Is there something wrong with putting on a condom? And for him saying, pull out, you know, that's... Uh, he was saying it to be funny, but at the same time, he wasn't. So, uh, I guess she just doesn't like the joke. Maybe that's why she's mad, but... Yeah. Uh, basically, technically, there is a hormonal male birth control. Uh, but it's technically uh, called uh, snipping of the nuts. Almost no man wants to have that. I know I don't. Oh, go outside and ask strangers who they'd pair up as a couple. Okay. So they're all on a date. Okay. And we want you to uh, match up who you think would be the best couple. These two would make a great couple. <laughs> yeah, that's a hot couple. <laughs> Why not these two? It's a little stiff. Nope, nope. I know they brought some random uh, woman from the street and all, but how the heck are you gonna pair, pair up two girls and just leave the two guys out of it? And the reason for it, too stiff? Too stiff? Like, I never heard of that. They don't look good uh, for, the, uh, for the girls because they look too stiff. Never ever heard of that before. Like... <sighs> Perfect. Let's walk back, guys. I would definitely want to go on a hike, maybe get some drinks. Yeah. Sounds like this was a date for you guys, actually. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. <laughs> yep. I think we'd have more fun. <laughs> yeah, you see the faces? Let your opponents doll you up with makeup. Oh! Yes! yes. <laughs> Let's do it. Trying to, dude. All right. Brow. Oh, brow gel. Let's do some brows. Sorry, I'm touching your eyeball. I think you are going to like this. You guys think this is hot? Not this makeup. I'm looking at each other. No, you look pretty good, man. <laughs> you got a lot going on. Yeah, yeah. Yo. Are you guys happy with that? Yeah. We got one. Drink that. You guys gotta do something humiliating now. We're still looking cute as heck. <laughs> but I'm obsessed with this look. Until. Eat a bowl of pasta without using your own arms. Like using their arm? Using. I'm wearing white. <laughs> so? No, I'm not drinking. Let's do it. How do you want it? Just, yeah. <laughs> do I want it? Yeah. Woo! <laughs> 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 That's disgusting, but it's, it's for fun. I would do it too. <laughs> Get blindfolded and make out with both of your dates. Give a bouquet of flowers. Here we to go. Let's do it. All right, round one. Go. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna pause it real quick. Now, uh, number one, if you guys are wondering why the tall guy is holding her like that like no that's um, i'm pretty sure that's not the way that he would actually kiss a girl he's doing it because he's trying to trick them into thinking that it's um the black guy because he's shorter so he was trying to lower himself to trick them now as for what's to follow and time let's swap let's yeah, swap let's swap let's swap you guys ready <laughs> He's just, uh, the black guy is literally just eating her Number mouth. Two. two. It's a tie. 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 
Me? <laughs> like bad? <laughs> yeah, she literally looks like she has clown uh, makeup lips. So that's about it. That's literally about all I could really take. But hopefully you guys understood where I was coming from with uh, how awkward and cringy this whole entire video was. So basically most of it was about uh, Anya uh, and the questions, her reactions and such. And the help with that uh, stranger uh, girl that they did, that didn't help whatsoever. It was just a whole bottle of mess. So, let me know what you guys think in the comments, and let me know if you think the same way that I do with this whole entire video. Yes, I should have put, warning, cringeworthiness is about to happen. <laughs> Alright y'all, I'll see you the next time. Let me know what you think. Like and share. Let me see what you guys think. I'm probably going to be doing more analysis for these videos because I was told that I should be able to do uh, analysis on these videos because a lot of people have been commenting on certain videos that I watched um, when I made a comment on a video and a lot of people say that I should do an analysis videos on most of these things so I'm probably going to do that. So hopefully this will be a series. Alright guys, I'll catch you the next time. Bisectomy. That's what it was called.